what's up you guys such boss here and today is autism wednesday on this edition of autism wednesday i'll be discussing with you guys my duties as the football manager for the football team and why i'm excited to go back for the sports season of 2020. um so pretty much guys the football season has just begun i was at practice today and i was at practice yesterday and it started on august 2nd today is august 4th and tomorrow's august 5th um, that's when Autism Wednesday will be uploaded for you guys. So, um, what exactly do what what exactly what I do for the team? Well, we're about to find different from other years for the football team because it's during the coronavirus, which is a really unique experience. Because I never experienced football by wearing a mask, because I don't have to wear a mask because the football team just wears helmets. I just wear I wear my street clothes and do my job. Um, this time, you have to be careful with. Um, hygiene and staying safe but the team is really good they're um, preparing for a big season this year we cannot go to Kentucky um, but I'm very hyped for what's going to happen so my job before the coronavirus was I was to go, uh, filling water bottles I go in and out um, on the field getting water bottles you may see me in action if you come to any of the games um, you may see Sasha Boss at high school just filling water hyping up the team it is really important to know that I love being the football manager. Another thing I do for the team, I hype them up with Turner the Chicken. So Turner the Chicken is pretty much um, a, a job, it's almost like a sanctuary, because I hold him up like an idol. He is almost like a, a hero to the team. Um, he's almost like a good luck charm, you know, lucky chicken, winner, winner, chicken dinner. That's what the motto is for Turner the Chicken, so that's why we have him. The things I, I really like doing for the team is really like learning about leadership and brotherhood, which I love learning about that. I don't think we really have that much culture meetings, maybe in school G Zoom, I'm not really sure how it works. But I know we have a bigger culture this year, um, a lot of things to learn from coach, and it's a big experience for a lot of you to learn about football. Uh, football is just a very big um, hobby. hobby of mine because um, I don't know nothing about the sport. I love learning about the sport, even though I, I'm, I'm a huge wrestling fan. And it's cool to learn about what football is. Um, football is all about brotherhood and team building, um, bonding with your friends. It's pretty much about how um, close you are. If you have friends, they look out for you all the time on the field. And Sarah like this one because um, it's a great way to make, make new friends. I made a lot of friends for the football team. I made a lot of comrades during my years working on the football team. I'm just hyped to work with them again. Um, I'm really good. I'm really close with some of the athletic trainers. Um, really close with the team, obviously. Um, the coaches look look out for me, and they're a very good environment for autism. Really, um, the, my school's football team is very like strong bonds with autism. Um, they do a lot for the community, and that's what I like about them. Like they're really strong and passionate, and even though we're bad, but we we try our best to defeat um, each team. We look out there. Um, we look tough. Um, that's what I like about them. It's a lot of fun. I like running out with the team. The team's really fun. Um, there's a lot of things you can do with autism for me. Is it's hard to make friends. It's just kind of like football is about leadership and brotherhood and like the bond, like true bonds, like Naruto and Sasuke, um, which are anime characters. But um, I just love football. It's just a lot of fun. It's like my favorite. It's like my second favorite sport to like work with because it's different seeing it on TV. Because there's a lot of things going on at once. Because I had to fill up water bottles. Obviously, I can't do that this year. I'm still waiting for my job and see what the opportunities are for the football season. I just I love working with the team so much. It just some of the things I like doing for everybody. I like to help others. That's what the boys need. Someone to look out for them. And someone to talk to. Them. I'm there for them. So I'm like really a part of the team. I just very feel comfortable working with them. I have a lot of relationships with everybody. Just like I said, um, another big thing about football is, is the like I said the bond. The bond is beautiful. But also like um, wearing the jersey. Once you officially like I'm wearing the jersey. So but um, once you officially put on the jersey it means you officially made the team in my opinion. But uh, if you do a lot to help out the team, you are you're obviously on the team. Like, I just treat them like my own, like your brothers, you know, family. Like the Ninja Turtles, for example. Hey guys, hopefully you guys did learn a little bit about what the football team means to me um, on Autism Wednesday. It's a lot of, like, a lot of things that go along with autism, like making friendships that I'm still working on, um, becoming a good leader, becoming a good father figure. Well, someday I have a daughter, but that'll be another story. But I just really hopefully you guys did like and subscribe to Such a Boss, and hopefully you do, do learn a little bit about the football team and what it means to me. Um, honestly, the football team is just super important in my life. It taught me how to be a good leader on the on and off the field. 
it's a good behind the scenes experience of what the actual people do because I work a lot with athletic trainers and I see like, injuries happen, I see water balls being filled, I see all the excitement. It's loud, it's fun. The whole team is loud and it's loud. It's a little bit nerve wracking at times, but because you don't get trampled on by the boys. So these guys are huge, they're in shoulder pads and cleats. So I'm like, you don't get trampled on, but those guys are awesome. So hopefully you guys do like and subscribe to such boss. And I'll give you more stories about the football season when it happens. Um, I can't wait to tell you if I get a job soon, but hopefully you guys do like and subscribe to such boss. And I'm ending the video now. Peace.